Like a Friday night on the weekend I feel blessed Welcome back to my channel. My name is Kayla. If you're new, I film hygiene, fragrance, and lifestyle related videos. So if that's something you're into, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Well, in today's video, as you can see by the title, I am going to be showing you my favorite vanilla fragrances in my collection. So I put emphasis on my because of course there are lots of different vanilla fragrances. There are some that I feel like I could have mentioned but just didn't. But you know, if you watch my videos enough, you'll pretty much know like which ones I really love and may have left out of this video. But if you want to see my favorite ones, just keep watching. So this first one pretty much comes off as a surprise because when I first picked it up, I felt like it was underwhelming to me because I was expecting more of a coffee scent. So this is Vanilla Mocha Cream from Bath & Body Works. And this one was a repackage of Vanilla Mocha Cafe. And I was never privy to get that fragrance so I did pick this one up when it came back to the December semi-annual sale so this is one it's like a like a light coffee scent light chocolatey vanilla type of fragrance this is something I feel like you can really get away with any time of the year just if you want something warm and comforting I feel like if you're not like a huge coffee fan this one will still be pretty much okay for you unfortunately this is not available right now but i'm sure if you go scouring the internet you can find this one but i really enjoy this fragrance especially at nighttime or just on like a rainy day when i just want something nice and warm and cozy and it's very yummy next i cannot talk about a vanilla fragrance video if i do not have my confetti cake pop so this is one that i have recently became like re with so when I first had this fragrance when it first came out I feel like I didn't appreciate it like I do now at all because when I first got it it kind of smelled artificial to me I was just like hmm it's okay but it was one of those instances that you don't know what you got until it's gone so yeah I definitely hit up somebody on Facebook marketplace to get this bottle right here this is my second or third bottle I have went through I think this is my third bottle so this is just like a cakey, vanilla, very dense type of fragrance. I love just sprinkling this with other fragrances just to give them like a vanilla aspect. So with this one, this is definitely for my gourmand lovers. This is available as Vanilla Confetti Sparkle right now for their summer collection. And I think it's about to hit 75% off soon. So if you hadn't got your hands on this yet, I feel like you should go ahead and get your hands on it now. If you do like this set, because I'm definitely going to be getting me a backup because as you can see I use this one quite often and it will be gone in no time so I definitely need me another one next this is from Sol de Janeiro and this is the Brazilian Crush 71 so this is like a nice salty caramel type of vanilla another very nice and warm type of scent I really really enjoy this one and I originally picked this up because I was told that this was a great scent for like you know when i want that coconut cream pie type of scent because they do smell very similar this one is just a little bit more dense in my opinion but i love anything caramel anything vanilla and it's really crazy because if you go back to my old cringy videos that i do not like i actually said in one of my videos that i'm not a vanilla e type of girl and it's like girl who are you because this girl right here i'm with all the vanillas but back then i was completely on smelling like candy fruit things like that i really wasn't too big on like cake and vanilla but now i'm literally obsessed so the brazilian crush 71 is a must have for vanilla and sweet lovers next i have miss bonfire bash and this is in the packaging from summer 2021 semi-annual sale and this is actually when i first became obsessed with this scent this was my first time ever owning bonfire badge as you can see she has a very nice dent in it so this is like your smoky fall vanilla even though i still wear this any time of year it really doesn't matter to me but i always say this this is a fragrance that the more I wear it, the more I smell it, I get much less smoke and a lot more creaminess. So this is like a grown and sexy vanilla. And I often like to wear this with vanilla bourbon from Mix Bar. That's really like a great fragrance combo in my opinion. Or you can even like, you know, wear some fruit with this and make it less smoky. But this one to me is a wonderful, sexy vanilla scent. 
this next one is a brand new favorite for me i'm literally obsessed with this i already have a backup and this is miss beach night so i know that there is a lot of different opinions on this scent but of course i'm just here to give you my own opinion this one to me smells just so delicious it smells like a caramel chocolatey marshmallow like just very sweet like not i guess not so much like caramel but it's like a salty i think the salt is what makes me think of caramel but i do like to mix this with caramel fragrances because together it just gives you like a caramel vanilla s'mores like you are just out on the beach at a bonfire and you are just you know roasting those s'mores and those graham crackers and it just smells amazing now this does not have chocolate on the scent notes but i feel like many of us pick up like a little hint of chocolate when we smell this fragrance and this on me is strong it lasts all day and i'll get compliments whenever i wear this and as you can see hopefully you can see you might not be able to <laughs> but i have used it down to here and i only recently bought this probably a couple of weeks ago so this is a good one to have in your collection as well next i actually picked this one up at tj maxx and the first time i ever seen this the first time I ever seen this fragrance, I was watching It's Mindy here on YouTube and she did a fragrance haul from Ulta and she was um, picking up a lot of different scents and I think she may have picked this one up from Kohl's if I'm not mistaken. I really don't remember. It was either Ulta or Kohl's but I remember she was like smelling it in the car but this is Golden Vanilla from Scentworks. I have no idea where you can find this one, but definitely try to look this up if you love a good sweet vanilla. This one right here, I have been obsessed with it and I really wish I had the whole set because this is one of the sweetest, strongest vanillas I have ever smelled. To me, this is like along the lines of like pumpkin pecan waffles for me. I'm obsessed with this. This is definitely not for those of you that don't like those thick sweet fragrances this is for those gourmand lovers but you know you can always tone this down with other things but this one right here this is just like that girl like she is just very sweet and tasty you will smell edible if you wear this vanilla and i really recommend this for vanilla lovers especially if you love those thick strong gourmand scents because i personally love to smell like a treat i love to smell like a bakery item and i feel like with this it's so versatile some may want to wear this like when it's colder outside but like i always say i don't care what time of year it is i'm gonna wear anything i want but this one right here is amazing and it lasts so long next i feel like a lot of us probably have this in our collections and a lot of people actually love this scent so this is the eos 24 hour body lotion in the scent vanilla cashmere this was one of the pivotal moments in my vanilla career that really launched me towards loving vanilla scents so this is my second bottle that i'm going through right now this just really smells like vanilla buttercream frosting to me and I remember a lot of people comparing this to Vanilla Bean Noel. To me, this is a little sweeter. It's not so artificial. And it just really smells like something that you would top a cake with. So I will say also, I do like the Vanilla Bean Noel from this year that many did not like at all because a lot of people say it had no smell. But to me, it smelled much better because the other one was just way too thick way too artificial i just could not get with it but this one right here just literally smells like buttercream frosting and i am obsessed with this i swear if you sprinkle this with anything you can definitely lighten something up you can sweeten something up i have worn in the stars with this and it just really gave it a different twist and a different view on the scent so even if you have that one and you think it's a little masculine try it with this or another vanilla scent and i swear you will not be disappointed so next this is actually just a little sample but this is something that i was sent from my boo so this is the kaoli vanilla 28 so i still have not bought the you know the full size of this yet but it's okay because i'm still loving on this one and as you can see the juice in here is very dark and she is just mature and she just smells really good so this gives me like a sweet brown sugar vanilla extract type of scent and once i get finished with 
with this I will definitely be buying me a full bottle I just still haven't did it yet after all these months because I've been just trying a whole bunch of different things but this is Kaoli Vanilla 28 and I feel like a lot of people love this fragrance and you may actually like it a little more after it sits and settles and matures like some brandy like we're like some wine like I feel like it just really gets better with age you know like me <laughs> but this next one this is new to my collection but I am obsessed so this is the birthday cake body oil from ancient cosmetics and I actually wore this today I wore this with confetti cake pop and buttercups and berry bellini I had like a strawberry vanilla cake combo going on and if you don't follow me on TikTok, make sure you guys follow me because I'm trying to do better I said that all the time and then I disappear but I'm trying but this one right here is just like your sweet birthday cake vanilla type of scent and I feel like if you want to just add like a little vanilla to your day this is the perfect one now if you get on their website and it's closed I don't have anything to do with that I'm sorry because they are a small business and small businesses especially body care businesses often close their website so that they can restock and if you catch them during one of those times just sign up for their email list and it'll actually notify you of when they are back up and running in stock because they make all of their things in-house and by hand and of course that takes time so I know I had some people on my community post looking to order this body oil and another one that I had picked up but the website was actually closed so that's what happens sometimes you just have to catch them but like I said just sign up for their email list and you will never miss when they have a sale or you will never miss when they restock their website next this is this I don't need a prince by my side to be a princess <laughs> so this one is like your marshmallow green tea type of scent but don't let that green tea note scare you off because I swear this is like a very nice fluffy marshmallow especially on the dry down it's very sweet you can mix this with so many things I have been wearing this with beach nights I have been wearing this with other marshmallow scents and anytime I just want to add like a little hint of marshmallow or a little hint of vanilla I will definitely pick this one up if I just want to sweeten something up it's perfect for those soft pretty days I feel like you will get complimented on this this is just such a nice fragrance and they did actually come out with a flask type of packaging right now and I'm really debating on whether I should pick that one up or not because I'm not finished with this one but the cool thing about this that I never knew because I feel like people never opened their fragrances when they showed these but I never knew that the juice was like inside of this little part right here and you know you have like the sprayer so this is actually the top but this sits on your vanity like this so I thought that was pretty neat next I did actually just mention this with a scent combo that I enjoy but this is vanilla bourbon from mix bar so in my opinion this is like a version of bonfire bash from bath and body works like a perfume version and i really enjoy this because it's not as strong as by the fireplace which i cannot deal with that scent it's very ashy and smoky to my nose but a lot of people do love it and some people think that this one smells masculine so of course definitely go and smell these for yourself but to me this is another sexy deep vanilla extract type of scent and I love to wear this when I just want to add like some grown vanilla to my fragrance profile for the day I feel like that's just a great addition and it's available at Target for only $18 so it's very affordable as well the last two I'm just gonna go ahead and put these two together because they are in the same scent family so we do have have here the original bare vanilla and also bare vanilla heat which recently was released so I love both of these so much so as you can see miss bare vanilla over here has been getting a complete workout and bare vanilla heat I've been using her too so the difference with this is this is like another deep sexy vanilla this has whipped vanilla and soft cashmere this one actually has spice mango solar coconut and vanilla so this one to me I don't know why it reminds me of margarita cupcake in a way it's like a citrusy summer vanilla it's a very sexy as well I just feel like you can just get away with both of these honestly anytime you want to wear them it's just like this one I feel like they turned it up a notch like this is really why it's called bare vanilla heat because they really turned the knob up on this one and I love it immensely so 
for right now those are all my favorite vanilla scents in my collection now an honorable mention would be cotton candy clouds with berry meringue or boardwalk taffy which to me they're all the same i don't smell a difference but i know a lot of people say they do but that's another one that i love but i feel like i mentioned that so so much i went ahead and left it out of this video but just a little honorable mention these are the ones I reach for most often. Of course, I do have other vanilla scents in my collection, but I just reach for these a lot. So if you have made it this far, leave me a vanilla ice cream cone emoji in the comments so that I know that you made it this far. And also let me know what are some of your favorite vanilla fragrances. Do we share some of the same fragrances and things of that nature? I definitely want to chat with you guys in the comments. And I've been really trying to get back up on my comment game because I have been slacking because I've just been getting so many comments, which I'm very, very grateful for. I'm just not used to having all these comments. So I've been trying. So if you see me comment on something that you wrote a week ago or two weeks ago just know I'm going through and commenting back or at least liking it to let you know that I've seen it so if you want to see more content like this make sure you subscribe I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next one bye guys